sometimes our ancestors knows better what is actually good for our skin instead. Hey my YouTube friends, how is everyone doing today? Hope you guys are enjoying my other videos where I go through the uh, natural beauty anti-aging um, routines that I've been practicing and seeing great results. If not, watch all the way until the end and I will include the, a link to the playlist where I put all those um, videos in. So um, stay to the end. So today what we're going to talk about is another ancient Chinese beauty secret, secret that I've always heard since growing up. Um, and now as I, um, I've noticed there's a lot of beauty product that's marketed it to have like the ingredients from that. So I decided, well, it's time to, for me to test it out. So I did some research and I came to a very easy recipe. So this is a skin brightening uh, toner that you can make at home for not even pennies. And it's extremely easy to make and easy to use. So it is rice water, fermented rice water skin toner. So it looks like this. So to start, it's very, very easy. You can just have a clear jar and I have a little bit of rice here. You can make a larger batch, but for me, since it's easy to make and I want to make sure it stays fresh and I don't have to dump um, extra that I can't use in time out, I just use a little bit. Well, it really doesn't have to be measured. Um, you can always test it out. So here I can, you can see I have a little bit and then I'm going to use water to rinse it out a couple of times to make sure, you know, if there's dirt, things like that on the surface. And you can just rinse it out. Just give it a good swirl for a little bit and dump it out. Repeat it one more time. And yeah, growing up, I've always heard save the, the rice washing water for your face because uh, it kind of brightens up the skin and minimizes the pore. So sometimes our ancestors knows better what is actually good for our skin instead of modern day seems like the industry keep pushing new um, chemical compound us promise us this is the the answer but for me i'm always um, wanting to find things that are natural no side effect and um, it's time tested so now you can see that after I did uh, rinse it a couple of times, uh, now I just filled it up with just about equal amount of water with rice, and then you let it sit for 12 to 24 hours. After you wait 12 to 24 hours, um, you'll get something like this. You can see the liquid is um, kind of white. A little bit milk like and that's what we want so get a little spray bottle and you can just pour it in and that's it this is our skin brightening natural fermented rice water syrup you can just spray it right like that. Lightly pat it in. You can use this in the morning, right under your moisturizer and before bed. And like me, I work in front of the computer all day long and a lot of time my skin gets pretty dry. I can just take it out and like replenish my skin's moisture th throughout the day. Um, after 
after I'm done spraying, I put it in the fridge to make sure it lasts a little bit longer. That's it. It is that easy. Just make it a part of your daily routine and over the time you are going to see your skin becomes brighter, lighter color, even more even tone, minimize, minimize the pull. And hey, let me know how it goes. I would love to hear your feedback. See you in the next video.